Did you know that you can use the submission data that is currently in your JotForm table to pre-fill another form for your users to make it so much easier for them to fill out? Let me show you how. Hey everyone, welcome to JotForm, I'm Kimberly, and honestly, this is probably one of my favorite additions to JotForm pre-fill. You already have submissions that are sitting in your tables, like I mentioned. Use that data to pre-fill other forms to make filling out forms for your users so much more simple. And that'll also increase your submission rate as well. So I'm already in a table for one of my forms where my submissions come. And over on the right-hand side of my table, I have a column that says add. I'm gonna go ahead and click add here. And then we have a option at the top called buttons. And now we have a new button called send form. We'll go ahead and click next. Now we need to rename our column. I'm gonna go ahead and use send form. I think that's a logical one for this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and click next. Now we get to choose which form we want to pre-fill. So for example, this one was a connect with me form. Maybe I want them to fill out this form right here. Now it automatically turned on the pre-fill capability, which is great. And it's already starting to map, but I also want it to map the name. Perfect, we'll go ahead and click next. Then from here, we need to have a way to send the form and email is probably gonna be your best bet. So we're gonna choose fields and then email and we can see the email has popped up there. If you wanna add an additional message here, you can definitely do that, but I'm gonna go ahead and create a column. And so you can see how simple it is to send a pre-filled form. All I have to do is just go down the row and click send form. I'm gonna go ahead and send one to myself so we can take a look at what that looks like. We can see that it was sent. So let me head to my email. And here we go, let's fill out our form and it's pre-filled out for us. So all we have to do is enter in our address and click submit and we'll be good to go. And it's as simple as that. So if you have any questions about utilizing the pre-fill 2.0 within your JotForm table, please let us know and I'll see you next time.